Hey guys, it's me, Geocoons, here with a bit of a, I don't know if I could call it a rant or not, but it, it's something that's been bothering me for the last couple of months, um, and it's been Smite's mode of the days. Their mode of the days have been rather lackluster in creativity, this one being uh, War and Peace, the one that's being played right now. Um, basically, the whole premise of it is, the gods of war are looking for a fight embrace the chaos or defend against the warbringers as the gods of peace in this clash skirmish all right i get that but here's the thing i'll pick you know and can and can be doubled over as you see here we have three zeus's a aries and me as erlong shin and on the other team you have a Bacchus and all neats all right you have gods of war to choose from versus gods of peace Alright, starting cooldown is at 40%. Maximum cooldown could be brought up to 80%. You have infinite mana. Starting level is 12, and your starting gold is 8,000. The map is obviously Clash. Now, here's my gripe with this. These modes of the days have been very basic. Like, I don't mind a gimmick on a mode of the day. Like, Laser Fight being one of my favorites. And that was a long time ago, where all the raws were on the field, and they all had alts to spam, and, you know, shit like that. That was fun, because it followed the gimmick of the name, Laser Fight. What I don't like is, everybody picks the cheapest combination. Everybody, every time. I picked Erlong Shin thinking, oh, they're gonna pick, you know, like, they're gonna pick Ares, they're gonna pick Odin, they're gonna pick Zeus. No, they, they just went straight, you know, like, everybody goes Zeus, everybody go, and, everybody goes Zeus, and one guy go Ares, and bam, there you go, you win. Like, this match was not fun. It wasn't. Like, I'm mowing through shit because they aren't noticing me because I'm Erlong shit. I'm not being anything effective. I'm just kind of here. What I would like is most of the days that kind of followed a gimmick. Something to make it interesting. Not just, oh, you can pick your gods in Assault. Oh, do we get infinite mana? No. Do we get a high amount of gold from the start? No. Do we start at max level? No. Then it's just a regular Assault. Except you can pick your god. That's, that's not cool. There's nothing cool about it. It may as well just be a regular joust then, you know? And it's been, it's been very bothersome to see... Like, I used to love Moda Day. I used to look forward to it all the time back in Season 2. Now, since Season 3 started, I've been... It's been from slowly not playing it to just not playing it in general. Like, it's a rare occasion for me to play it. So now it's like, all right, high res. Do you want mode of the day to be there, or do you not want it to be there? And then the fact that you get no quests done doing mode of the day—that's kind of making it even less of a reason to play it. Like, if they were gonna update anything, I would update that the quest can be done in mode of the day. Like, bottom line, it's it's there. You should allow people to complete quests in your mode of the day. You know, they shouldn't be forced to play, like, anything else. Like, if they like mode of the day over all the other modes, let them play that and complete their quest. You know? Oh, but it would be too easy to complete the quest. Yeah, I get that. I get that. But most of the time, your modes of the day are like regular modes. Just with, you know, we can pick the god. Like, that's literally all it is. Like, either we can pick the god, or you just give us high cooldown with no infinite mana. So, I would like that. Like, Omnipotent, Grab Bag 2.0 are probably the only two that are worthwhile anymore. And that's only because you get a ridiculous cooldown. You get a ridiculous cooldown. So, yeah. Like, I don't want mode of the day to be a forgotten memory. I want it to be great, like it used to be. You know, like Halloween, everybody pick horror icon skins. You know, like they're allowed to pick the horrors, the horror skins. 
you know, and then give them infinite mana to play around with. Because when you give somebody infinite mana, it sparks interest in the character, like showing what they're capable of. Like, you're not gonna be expected to play that way in a regular mode, no. But, whenever you, like, I don't like Fenrir. I don't like playing as Fenrir. He's honestly not that good for me. But, you give me infinite mana with him, and high cooldown, I can do some funny stuff with him. I can actually go in, I can go to town with him. But, every time, you know, you limit the player, it just makes it eh. But I don't know, I just think Mode of the Day has lost all purpose at this point. Like, I, at this point, I would rather have Shin Chin's Mountain replace Mode of the Day. That's how, that's how bad it's gotten. I would rather have a mode that literally has no penalty for quitting or backing out of because it lasts so sh it, it's such a short amount of time wasted. That's why I don't think Shin Chen's Mountain is that bad of an idea because you're not in it long enough to complain really. You really aren't. You're in there for maybe a round or two and that's like what 30 seconds? So you can't really bitch you know like oh man. This player was da da da, and this player no, you can't because it's random. You're gonna get that. You're gonna get that round that shit fucks you over. That's how it's gonna happen. So I don't know. I can't. I can't really call this video a rant. It more as an opinion. Cause uh, it's it's so boring. This mode is so. Boring. This mode is very boring. War and Peace. Oh, you can pick these specific gods. Alright, cool. Nobody picks half of what you let them pick. Nobody. Because they're going to pick the easiest to hit gods. Why do you think there's so many Zeus's and Neith's and Ares and Bacchus? These are the easiest characters to hit people with. They really are. At the end of the day, they really are easy to hit with. It's just a shame that I've lost all love for mode of the day. I've lost all all love for it. Just like with Conquest. Like, I used to think Conquest was, was legit. Like, I don't mind Conquest. It's just that I won't play it. Unless, you know... I have to be in a very competitive state of mind to play it. Because that's what Conquest is. It's competitive. Like, compared to Joust, Assault, Arena, and Clash, Conquest is by far the only one that I would touch ranked. So. But that that's just my opinion on Mode of the Day. And a bunch of other stuff. I know I was rambling for a while, but... It, it, I don't, uh, I want mode of the day to be fun. That's all it is. I just want mode of the day to have some purpose and some fun. I want it to be fun again. Hell, bring domination back if you want. But that's my time. I, I hope you guys didn't mind this video or enjoyed it. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs down. Like, comment, subscribe. Do whatever you want, you know? I'm Geo Coons. And I'll see you in the next video. Later, dudes.